hi guys so welcome back to my channel so today's recipe is chicken bacon and ranch pasta let me tell you warning it is super cheesy super creamy super delicious I promise you're going to fall in love with this pasta dish so let's get straight to the recipe we're gonna go ahead and start by preparing our chicken I am using chicken breast two of them big td breast td breast what the fuck what is wrong with me anyway td chicken <laughs> okay so i added a about a tablespoon of oil, olive oil in the bag so that way the chicken doesn't tear so go ahead and flatten it first so it could cook evenly so after you've done that go ahead and transfer it to your bowl and we're gonna start with the seasoning i will list the measurements in the seasoning that i'm using in the description box below be sure to check it out so we're also using this i don't know i've just started using this and it's super bomb so go ahead and add some freshly ground black pepper because who uses pre-grounded stuff i don't anyway so i'm using this goya marinade it's super delicious it makes my dish it gives it this kick my dish was already great but it just makes it even better now so go ahead and add about two to three tablespoons of that and then we're gonna add some lemon juice if you don't have lemon juice lime juice a little vinegar works too or bitter orange juice so go ahead and add some lemon juice to it and go ahead and stir it make sure it's evenly coated and let it season let it marinate for a few minutes i didn't have a lot of time so only let it marinate for 15 minutes that was enough honestly so let's go ahead and go over all the ingredients that we're gonna be using for the pasta guys when i tell you this pasta is bomb whew, unsalted butter some bacon chopped up fresh garlic cloves six of them I love garlic some more of the freshly ground black pepper you said ground your own black pepper please get the peppercorn and ground it some olive oil and some seasoning all-purpose chicken seasoning and also some chicken bouillon powder onions of course extra flavor ranch because that's what the pasta is about some sour cream to make it even creamier heavy milk heavy milk heavy cream i can't even speak because this dish is so good and for cheeses i am using sharp cheddar i am using monterey jack i am using parmesan cheese that i grated myself and some mozzarella so as you can see all the cheeses are shred um grated i did that myself i didn't buy the pre-shredded stuff so i did that on my, by myself because when you get the cheese pre um shredded it lost its moisture and it's not as good anyways go ahead and add to your hot grill pan add a tablespoon of olive oil and go ahead and transfer your chicken breast to that pan be sure to put it on the side that you're gonna serve it and after about five minutes go ahead and switch flip your chicken sides and let it cook on the other side and I'm also using this little marinade to give it extra flavor because you know more flavors is better so now let's do the fun stuff so to your hot pan that I cooked my I already cooked my pasta El Dante so to your hot pan go ahead and add a tablespoon of butter and when your butter start melting make sure the heat is on medium low at this point while you because now we're going to cook the garlic and the onions so your heat can be on medium low but not too high because you don't want to burn the butter okay just gonna melt it and then infuse the garlic and the onions so we're gonna cook the garlic and the onions until it's translucent So when your garlic and onion is looking like that, go ahead and add the heavy cream. Ooh, wait. 
and go ahead and add your seasoning like I said I'm for this seasoning I'm using Laurie's all-purpose chicken seasoning and chicken bouillon so I'm gonna go ahead and add some of the cheeses I'm gonna add all the mozzarella cheese though but the other shredded cheese I'm gonna leave them for a little bit later so go ahead to lower your heat on low and let the cheese melt so while I'm doing this my bacon is cooking in the back as you can see go ahead and transfer your cooked pasta into the bechamel the cheese sauce and give it a stir make sure everything is evenly coated oh my god do you see the do you see that do you see the pool on this <laughs> oh the bacon is cooking so you can cook your bacon in the oven or like that so I did that because it's faster I don't know just cook it on that let it get crispy you want the bacon to be crispy okay make sure it's crispy crispy so go ahead and keep stirring so now we're gonna go ahead and add our sour cream and um what's the other thing oh my god the ranch I'm using buttermilk ranch so use any ranch you could find so I added one fourth cup of sour cream and I am also adding half a cup of ranch because listen this is chicken bacon and ranch pasta so there's gotta be a lot of ranch in there okay so go ahead and stir it up oh my god look at the pool on that like I said, I told you, it's it's cheesy. It's cheesy and creamy, okay? Cheesy and creamy. That's what you call cheesy and creamy, okay? If cheesy and creamy had a look, this would be it, all right? Oh my goodness. This dish, this creamy and this cheesy should be illegal. So go ahead and add the remaining of the sh shredded cheeses. Okay, I just I think I, I might be I might get arrested. I don't know because whew, this is too much. Like Cindy, you did it again. Ooh. <laughs> anyway, so now I added my black pepper because I want to taste the black pepper. That's why I did it last. So go ahead and stir. I'm telling you, I I think I've committed a crime again. And I am guilty okay I am guilty as charged so as you can see my bacon in the back is already done it's pretty crispy and you guys be sure to check on the chicken I know I like so focused on this pasta right now because this is like a lot to take in okay I get it I understand I understand okay but be sure to check on the chicken make sure it's cooked the chicken should take about 10 minutes to fully to be fully cooked we want the chicken to be fully cooked there's no such thing as medium cooked on chicken there's no such thing as it's gotta be cooked full it's gotta be well done when it comes to chicken okay so be sure to check it out so anyways guys this is the final product we're gonna go ahead and start plating so my chicken is perfectly cooked it's done anyways if you like this video please hit the subscribe button for more okay because I have a lot more to come okay so go ahead and do that and then at this point right now you should hit the thumbs up button look at this you guys look at the results Wow and also then do not forget because I forgot to sprinkle a little bit of ranch on the dish so that's why the first pizza didn't have um, ranch anyway so this is the final product you guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you don't like this video give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel for more and as you're subscribing also hit the notification bell button so you could be alerted when i upload a new video as always thank you guys for watching i really 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 hope you give this recipe a try because it is super delicious like it is if you ever had um if you've ever had um chicken bacon and ranch pasta then trust me you're going to love this because this is why i got the idea okay so if you give it a try let me know anyways thank you for watching i will see you very soon Bye.
hi i'm back <laughs> anyways as i was listening to my i was watching my video make sure that my editing is great i realized that towards the ending that i said if you've ever had chicken and bacon and ranch pasta <laughs> that's not what i meant i meant pizza because that's where the um inspiration came from chicken bacon and ranch pizza we ordered out from work and then i was like oh wait i should do this i should make a pasta out of this and that's what i did so chicken bacon and ranch pizza is what i meant to say if you've ever had that okay then you're going to love this chicken bacon and ranch pasta <laughs> okay anyways listen sometimes i can't speak and i don't know why but you get it anyways enjoy